Welcome to the chorus portion of our concert. My name is Katie Spagnolo. Um, I teach fifth grade chorus and six and eight general music at Sanford Middle School. Uh, raise your hand if you were just on stage with the band. Nice and high. Give these guys a round of applause. These kids are like some of the most organized people in the world. They are right on top of it. We're very, very proud of them. But enough for me from now, we're gonna get singing. Thank you. That was the Banana Boat song some of you may recognize from the movie Beetlejuice. Um, before we sing our last piece, I just wanted to give you a little bit of a backstory of how we came to choose this piece. So, um, obviously, they're in fifth grade, and a big part of being in fifth grade chorus is 
fostering a love of singing and building confidence. So for me as the chorus teacher, that means choosing pieces that I could use as a learning tool, but also um, you know, songs that they want to sing. And there's this really, really awesome chorus out of New York City in Staten Island called P22 Chorus. And there's like 70 fifth and sixth graders in this school district that are in chorus. And the chorus teacher does a really great job making singing fun and accessible for everybody. And I saw that they did a version of Golden Hour and I fell in love with it. So when I was trying to convince these lovely folks in fourth grade to join fifth grade chorus, I was like, how many of you love the song Golden Hour? And they're like, I do. And I was like, we're gonna do it. And they're like, okay, I'm in. And then I was like, I gotta find a piece of music for this. So then I was trying to find an arrangement, couldn't find one. And then I was on YouTube and I found an arrangement by this composer named Emily Drum. The problem was it was for high school. However, her contact info was below. So I send her an email. I say, hey, this is Katie Spagnuolo from Stanford Middle School. I would really love for you to write an arrangement of Golden Hour for my fifth grade chorus students. And she was like, okay, I'm down. So this next arrangement that you're going to hear was written specifically for the students that are standing behind me. Yeah, that's pretty awesome. <laughs> And the thing about learning a pop piece is there's a little bit of an extra challenge because when there's harmony, no one wants to sing the harmony. Everybody wants to be the rock star and sing the melody. So this was a little bit of a stretch piece for us, but we've worked really hard on building the skill and singing in two-part harmony. And uh, last but not least, I wanted to say that it has been an absolute pleasure to teach your children for the last two years. And um, they are the highlight of my day. I tell them that every single day when I see them, don't I? Every time I see you, I tell you. Yeah. Yeah. That's true, I do. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, and thank you so much for supporting their desire to be a part of the performing arts. Even if they never say thank you, I'm, I'm speaking from my own experience, I can tell you that your support matters a lot. Um, and last but not least, before we sing, thank you for your patience. Um, after the concert, all of the band and chorus students will go back to our two rooms back here. They will pack up their things, and we are asking families to meet us in the lobbies out here. And with that, let's get to Golden Hour.